In this video, we will be covering how to use the NIMAC Watchlist feature found in the Authorized User and Accessible Media Producer accounts. After you have logged into your account, you will navigate to the Manage Watchlist button, which is on the upper right-hand side of the screen, and click it. You'll input the ISBN in the ISBN field, which is required. As a reminder, it is always best to copy and paste the ISBN in this field rather than typing it in, if possible, to avoid typos. Also, ensure that there aren't any hyphens included in the ISBN. Now, the ISBN I entered on screen is not a valid ISBN, but the system doesn't check for that. A staff member will verify your ISBN when they're researching your request. Now, once you've entered your ISBN, you'll move on to the memo field which is a new and optional field where you can put any information you have about the material you need. If you need a little refresher on what goes into the memo field, we also have a short video about that. Now what I'm entering is just the title, the publisher, the copyright year, and that it's a Florida edition. And so now that we have our ISBN and memo field information in place, we can click the Create button. And you can see here that that item will appear on your watch list. The NIMAC receives a daily report of everything added to the watch list, and a staff member will reach out to you. And that's really all there is to the watch list feature. If you have any issues with this or any feedback, feel free to reach out to us. We are always happy to help.